Hello and welcome to the tutorial videos on Moodle. You all have learned about the topic management icons. Now let us see how each of this icon functions. Uh, let us see the first icon that is this pencil icon which allows you to edit the title of any uh, resource or activity on the main page itself. So when you click on this icon, you get a chance to edit the title. So let us say you want to edit this design part and rename it as development. After you are done editing, simply press enter and your title is now changed. Suppose you don't like this arrangement of the resource and you want to move it towards right, simply click on the small arrow icon, move right and the entire uh, resource will get indented towards right. If you don't like this arrangement, you want it again backwards, uh, then just click on this move left icon and the indention will go. It will be back to its normal arrangement. Let us say you want to move this entire resource below this second activity uh, that is an assignment. Compare the CD models. There is a third icon over here called move. Simply click on it and drag the resource below this assignment. And it is done. Now you can see the placement of this particular resource is changed. The fourth icon is update. Update allows you to change the entire resource or edit the entire resource. So when you click on it, you get to make changes to that particular resource or activity. So if you want, you can change the display option or anything or change the description name or this link anything after that just click on save and return to course and now that particular resource is updated the fourth icon is duplicate uh, duplicate as the name suggests allows you to create a copy of that particular resource or assignment so when you click on it Moodle will ask you whether are you sure you want to duplicate that particular resource then you just have to click on continue and uh, the resource has been duplicated successfully so return to the course as you can see now the resource the bones model curriculum development has its another copy and which is exactly below it so this is how the duplicate icon functions now you don't want this duplicate icon or uh, so to remove this or to delete any particular resource or activity there is another icon called delete so when you click on it delete that particular resource or activity will get deleted when you click on ok it's gone that resource and activity is completely gone now let us say you don't want to delete it but you just want to hide it from the students. You want the resource in the Moodle but you don't want the students to see it. Then there's another uh, icon called hide. This eye icon which you can see. So when you click on it, the eye will change to a strike uh, a strikeout eye which means that this resource, it is there but it is hidden from the students. Now you again want to unhide it then simply click on it again show and again it is back so this is how each of this uh, topic management icon functions there are some other icons as well present over here for each topic the move uh, it functions exactly uh, as the move which i showed you earlier so if this topic one you want to move this topic one this entire course below the topic two section then you can even do that. To do that, uh, just drag this topic one below and just bring it down, bring it down. And in the topic two section, you can put it. So now you can see you have dragged the topic one below and you have brought it in the place of topic four. If you want it in the place of topic 3, you can even do that. Again, just drag it and now it has become the topic 3. 
this is how you can drag the whole sections uh, also you can uh, hide this entire section from the students so if you don't want your students to see the topic 3 but you want them to see the topic 1 and topic 2 then you can hide the topic 3 by click on on this hide topic and this entire section will be hidden from the students you can see the entire section has turned gray that means it is hidden to show it or to unhide it to back to the students just click on this eye again and it is back the other important icon is the highlight icon which uh, allows you to highlight that particular section as the current topic which means that students will now know that okay this is the current topic the others are outdated topics or the others are done this is the currently uh, current topic on which they are supposed to work so you can see it has become red which means it is highlighted it is the main topic for this particular course so this is how all these icons function another icon over your small you can see edit summary it is similar to the update option which you saw uh, earlier uh, when you click on it you can change the topic name uh, for now we have selected use default section name but you can uh, uh, remove the tick mark and you can name the section as per as you want you can name the section as uh, course name or curriculum development or in the summary you want you can add any summary this is the current course you can write or any other thing you want to write and click on save changes so now as you can see the topic 3 is renamed to course name curriculum development and below it the description has also appeared which is this is the current course this is how easy it is to uh, handle the course with all these icons uh, thank you for watching